Hey y'all, here's a quick video on how to set up the governor and throttle linkage on one of these little brigs. It's a pretty simple setup really. You see there's a linkage that runs from the governor to the throttle. You see here how that works. And the spring ties into the linkage here and is connected to your throttle control here. That way when you, when you give it full throttle it's putting more tension on the spring. When it's down low there's no tension on the spring works off the governor. I'll show you how the governor works. Now if your engine ain't running as fast as it used to on full throttle you can stretch just take a few lengths out of this spring make the spring a little bit tighter but don't do it too much or you'll be running it too fast. This type of setup is called an air vane governor. It works off the air coming off the flywheel fins. It cools the engine. See, like at idle, the linkage is closed. See how it works? Then, as soon as the RPMs start dropping, this will come down and open the throttle up more so it revs up. According to the RPM, is adjusted by the spring tension on the governor here. See how the spring works? And of course this bolt right here goes down through the coil and molds down to the block. Here's a closer view of the linkage. You can see how the spring hooks to it. You can see I've uh, made this spring a little bit tighter. As you've seen in the last video, I was bypassing the governor when it was running and giving it complete full throttle, which ain't good for him. Well, there's a quick little video on the governor throttle linkage on these little engines. If you got any questions, let me know and I'll try to help you. Thanks for watching.